When average W students talk about colonial sports, they often fail to mention one of the school's most successful teams, men's squash. Men's squash has a record of 13 wins and six losses and ranks among the top 20 teams in the nation. And yet, you almost never hear about them. Many students don't even know what squash is. It's kind of like tennis, I think. <laughs> is it in the little room? Is that squash? That's racquetball. Wait, I don't know. No, I'm from the Midwest, so I know nothing about squash. I'm not really well versed in the squash team. These students are not alone. Even close relatives of the players are not always well versed in the makeup of the game. My mom's from Birmingham, Alabama, and her whole family thought I played a uh, vegetable when they first heard about squash. So, uh, yeah. So a lot of people don't know, and a lot of people here don't know what squash is either. It's mainly just kids from the uh, Northeast that know what it is. The squash team thinks it deserves more attention given its team camaraderie and players' strong performances. Adam Pistol, a junior on the team, urges Colonials fans to come see for themselves. It's a really fun game. I think a lot of people play it for leisure and for fun. Um, it seems to be sparking a lot of interest around the campus, so you know, I, I'd say to anyone just come out and check it out. And it's the atmosphere we created here is very fun. Uh, we like rowdy fans, so anyone likes to be rowdy, just come out and support us. Coach Wendy Lawrence says she already feels the energy behind her team. They feel a little lost in the publicity side of, of GW Sports, but they also feel that that's changing. The crowds that come to their matches have grown dramatically in the last two or three years. Now we get 300 kids coming to a game, and I dare say that arguably that's more than some basketball games get. The GW squash team's popularity is expected to grow with standout players like Islam El Fiki, an Egyptian player who is internationally ranked. The coaching staff is also promising to continue strong recruiting, especially since GW is the only school in the United States that gives out scholarships for squash. The men's team will head to nationals at the end of February and will bring their team spirit and upbeat attitudes with them. Reporting for The Source, Lindsay Life and Michael Soroka.